this is Blue Leader and we're here in Boston, Massachusetts where they have a total of eight superchargers at the Van Ness Garage. Let me give you my initial impressions of the supercharger and the surrounding area. Initial thoughts, first thought, you are indoors, underground, so you're on level P3 by the way. So when you come in, loop your way down, three levels down, and you're gonna see eight superchargers against the wall. Initial feelings, I've got a feeling of excitement because right across the street is Fenway Park, where the Boston Red Sox play baseball. If you're here to watch an awesome baseball game, uh, watch people hit home runs over the Green Monster. This is the place to supercharge. Just make sure you get out of the way so others can supercharge. Because I know all you Boston fans don't just live in the great state of Massachusetts. A lot of you guys uh, commute from other states coming in to invade this area to make sure your socks win. Initial concerns. No concerns, very well lit, lots of LED lighting. But like most indoor parking garages, you're away from the elements outside, but it's a little bit stuffy here, so you might not want to hang out here and turn on your, your air conditioning. Anyways, thanks a whole bunch for hanging out with us. Please keep showing that support by hitting the like and subscribe. And if you know anyone that wants to hang with us, make sure you share the content over with them. Thanks a whole bunch and hang tight for the guest review. It's great. Every time that you come to a big city, uh, the superchargers always pay strategically, so it's always centralized with places to go eat. Uh, there's entertainment. Fenway's right here, uh, so it's pretty awesome to know that there's a charger right down the street and you can have it fully charged when you leave the game. Now, are you guys going to go to Fenway Park? Or are you going to visit? Yes, we're actually going right now. <laughs> it's actually a tour of the, of the uh, stadium, so we're just taking the history in. Excellent. That's an excellent tour and I, I encourage everybody to take tours of all baseball stadiums to see the guts of everything. If there was no supercharger here, would you still come back to this parking structure, this area? Yes, they would. Of course, yeah. Is this... How come? There's so many things to do around here. Uh, parking's right on the street, so... And it's pretty close to vicinity to places, um, so I'll definitely come back to this area. It's great. We're in Boston, so any seafood restaurant that has lobster rolls, yep. Uh, there's Wall Burger down the street right here. Uh, there's Tasty Burger right here. Staples of the city. So definitely some. There's all kinds of stuff around here to eat. Now I'm wondering, what's the furthest road trip you've taken in your Tesla Model Y? Well, I went from Dallas, so I'm from Houston all the way to Dallas. How long of a drive is Houston to Dallas? It's about four and a half hours. Four and a half hours. Yeah. Did you have to charge along the way? Yeah. So there's along the way Model Y when you map directions. It pops up with all the supercharger, it tells you how much you have and how much you have left. So I just charged one time when I was there. Yeah. How was the ride? It was great, you know. I'm from California. They're thinking of charging us an EV tax per mile, like up to 30 cents. Yeah. Would you be supporting that if it, that came to the great state of Texas? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Thumbs down. Depends on what it supports, but yeah, thumbs down. <laughs> uh, they say it's for road maintenance, yeah. highway maintenance. Still, would you give it a thumbs up or thumbs down? Highway thumbs down. <laughs> How come? <laughs> well, we, we already have a tax, uh, not a tax, but a fee when we register the car, so it's more than the regular ones also. So it kind of defeats the purpose of getting an EV. We're trying to save money, trying to do the environment, so we're trying to get more taxes and more things. It doesn't make it appealing to get cars, so an EV car, so. Makes total sense. Yeah. Guys, thank you so much, Mai and Val. What do you have, what final words of wisdom do you have for the people out there before we take off? You know what, it's all about tests, it's all about traveling, so go out there and explore. Uh, it doesn't matter the destination, there's always gonna be a supercharger when you get there. <laughs> thank you so much, guys, we'll see you later. Thank Bye. you. So you guys are from Houston, Texas, but you're wearing Boston colors. Uh, tell us, tell us about that. <laughs> well, we well, try to say, go yeah, ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> we try to say neutral, just the colors, <laughs> not the team. <laughs> so I can find each other, get lost. <laughs> Very good. Do you like the Rockets better or 
the Red Sox. I'm mm. sorry, the, the Astros, Astros better or the Red it's Sox? It's going to have to be the Astros. Astros. <laughs> yeah. Okay, very good. But you're blending in pretty good. Yeah. <laughs>